Hey everyone, it's Angela from abpan.com and it is 6.30 right now. Can you see? 6.30 a.m. And so this video is for all those people who always ask me, how do you get up so early every day? Well, I have to tell you it's not every day. And I only wake up um, when I think the weather is going to be good. Um, sometimes on weekends I don't wake up because just to maintain a social life, I would like to um, stay up a little bit later than I then going to sleep at like 10 p.m. And um, so this is how I wake up early in the morning. So first of all, I wanted to say that I still don't consider myself a morning person. I still get really sleepy in the mornings and I have to drag my butt out of bed to wake up. So. Um, I mean, even when I was a teenager, my, even when I was a teenager, I used to always go to sleep late, wake up late. I'd probably wake up, like, average time, like, 10 a.m. or, like, 11 or even 12. But, I mean, that's just what I'm used to and that's just what I like doing. I like sleeping in and I like sleeping. But I wake up so early in the morning because... I mean, that's when the best light for photography is, for landscape photography. So I'll wake up, um, I go to sleep around, okay, so it's summertime right now. So sunrise um, on the east coast is about 6 o'clock in the morning right now. So I'll probably wake up, or I'll go to sleep around 10 at night. Um, I'll wake up around... Right now, I'll wake up around 4.30, 4.45. This morning, I woke up at 4.45. And then, um, I'll get ready. You know, I'll put on my workout gear, the clothes that I want to work out in. And then, I'll go out and take pictures. And I'll be done around this time, around 6.30. And then, um, straight after this, I will go work out. I'll go to the track. I'll go to the gym. I'll go to um, this running trail by my house. Or I'll even just go home and do some like workout DVDs or something like that. Um, so my motivation to get up in the morning is one, it's the best light. So um, that's when I'll get my best pictures. Two, I committed to a daily blog every day um, last year, Monday through Friday, that I'll have a new blog picture, new content every day so um it kind of forces me to get out of bed when i know i don't have anything to post that day or um i'm just running out of uh things to put up on my blog so i'll make sure i get out of bed so this is for everybody out there that i'm not a morning person i don't particularly enjoy waking up in the mornings but i mean when I do wake up early in the mornings, like today, I do get a lot of things done. I wake up, I take pictures, I work out, I, um, I work out, I'll go home, I'll eat my breakfast, take a shower, I'll answer a few emails, like, answer all of my emails that came through overnight. Um, I'll kind of get, like, all these little things out of the way, and then by that time, it's already, like, eight nine o'clock and that's when my day actually starts I'll start hitting my to-do list and like scratching things off and so I get a lot of things done you know when I wake up so early in the morning I also don't feel bad about taking naps because I have okay so I woke up at 4 the 45 let's just say that was 5 so I wake 5 6 7 8 9 10 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'll be up today for 17 hours. And that is a long day. Uh, I don't feel bad for taking naps. I take about like half an hour, like 20, 30 to an hour minute nap. Um, if I have to. Usually in the afternoon, like in the late afternoon, three or four I'll start crashing and I just have to revitalize myself a little bit. So that is how I wake up 
my motivation to wake up. You know, and I, and to actually get myself out of bed. When I was in high school, it was the worst. Like, I would... Uh, my bedroom was on the second floor, and my parents' bedroom was on the, like, ground floor. And then, so, I would be such a heavy sleeper that, uh, that I would set my alarm, and I would set it to the loudest that it could be. Like, uh, and it would be right by my head, like, right here. And then I still would sleep through that, but it would be so loud that it would wake my mom up on the ground floor. So once my alarm went off, my alarm would wake my mom up. And then she would come upstairs and wake me up. Because, like, I just am such a heavy sleeper that I didn't even hear it. That's so crazy to me now. But even today, like, I have to set, like, three or four alarms to actually, so that I can actually hear it. And that I actually am conscious enough so that I know that I have to wake up. Um, so... This morning I wanted to get up at 4.45. So I set my first alarm at 4.10, then 4.20, 4.30, and then 4.45. And then that's when I actually got up. So, I mean, it's not easy for me at all. But I just do it because um, I like t waking up taking pictures. I just wish it wasn't so early in the morning every time. But, you know, um, just got to do what you got to do, right? <laughs> So, uh, let me know if you guys have any other questions, or if you ever want me to talk about anything else related to photography, or anything like that. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye.